boys and girls. Well, it's another nice day today, which has not been too often. We would have had a lot more inside recesses if we had stayed in school. Today I have a story for you that we've read before, but we're going to use it to help us think about our new writing topic. This book is called Don't Let the Pigeon Stay Up Late, and the words and pictures are by Mo Willems. So in this story, our friend the pigeon is trying to persuade, which means sort of like talk somebody into something that he wants to have happen. So what he's going to do is he's going to give reasons why he thinks he should get to stay up late. And when we do our writing, we're going to think about something and then try to think of reasons why we should get to do it. So I'm going to read you this story now and I want you to be thinking, how does the pigeon try to talk us into letting him stay up late? is on right now. Oh good, it's you. Listen, it's getting late and I need to brush my teeth. Can you do me a favor? Don't let the pigeon stay up late. Thanks. First of all, I'm not even tired. In the mood for a hot dog party. What do you say? <laughs> I think that bird wants to do it. No? Hmm. I think he's thinking. What else can he say to change our minds? I hear there's a good show about birds on TV tonight. Should be very educational. minutes in the grand scheme of things. What? What? I'm not tired! Get upset. You know, we never get to talk anymore. Tell me about your day. great idea. We can count the stars. Can I have a glass of water? Studies show that pigeons hardly need any sleep at all. Hey, hey, ho, ho, this here pigeon just won't go. Please. It's the middle of the day in China. I'll go to bed early tomorrow night instead. My buddy wants to stay up too. You can't say no to a bunny, can you? <laughs> okay, that was not a yawn. I was stretching. having his hot dog party in his dreams. So in this story, the pigeon didn't get his way. I know you guys always want to see where... Uh, he didn't get his way, but how did he try to get his way? How did he try to talk us into letting him stay up late? So think about some of those reasons, and you can um, put them in the comments or email them to us, what you think the reasons were he got to stay up late and be thinking about if you were to write a story about you wanted to stay up late, what would you say to your mom and dad? All right, have a good day.